Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back. Um, I'm gonna try to keep this short and sweet. Uh, I went to Kroger today. Well, I set up a Kroger pickup today and I just went and picked it up. Uh, my total was around $120, um, which once you see my haul, doesn't feel like that great, but we've got what we needed from the list and it was still within budget, it just, wasn't the best haul for the price this week, it seems like. So we'll make it work. Uh, so let me stop blabbing and uh, let's get to the haul. All right, guys. So like I said, around $120, I believe today. I'd have to check my email. Um, Cause like I said, I did a pickup order, uh, but it's clearly not a lot. <laughs> um, so we've got K-Cups. Um, I bought some cold brew packets uh, so that I can start doing some of my own like Dunkin' cold brew at home. Um, because of that, I got the creamer that doesn't hurt my belly that I like. My husband's not picky. He doesn't really care. He'll drink whatever vanilla creamer. Um, so that one's one I get because it's, it's what tastes and feels best for me. Um, I've got some chocolate chip cookies for Mark, per usual, his energy drinks. I'm getting low on mayo, so I picked some of that up. Uh, we've got two packs of chicken breast tenderloins. Um, I ordered the bag of like cut broccoli. They have some right now. Um, it's like $2.99, um, and it's a good size bag. And I mean, for the price, I don't have to cut it all up. There's not a ton of waste because I feel like a big chunk of the stem just like it, it's a waste like you don't I mean some people might eat it I'm not so I I prefer the bag they didn't have any they gave me a couple heads of broccoli in um, as a substitution um, I've got shampoo and conditioner back here this is kind of new um, I've used this shampoo before and I really liked it um, and I'm almost out of conditioner and I don't love the one that I've been using and it's pretty expensive. So I figured I would try the conditioner uh, that's from the same brand as the shampoo because I know that I like it. So hopefully I'll like this as well. Um, I got some tampons because mother nature is great. Um, we've started getting these the last like few weeks for Zazu. Uh, we used to always get him milk bones, but he's kind of I mean, I guess it's fair. He's kind of over them. Like sometimes you give them to him and he's like spits them back out and is like, yeah, no thanks. I'll, I'm good. So we figured we get him something a little more fun. These uh, do not at all meet um, my husband's particular requirements <laughs> about what we give the dog. We're very picky. Um, he absolutely does not get rawhide. It is so bad for your dogs if you're giving it to them. Please, please look into it. So bad. Um, we do like rawhide free types of chews. Um, he gets, uh, food that's like very like, natural, if you will. Um, like we're, we're kind of picky about, um, what we give him. We try to make sure he's getting what he should and not getting anything he shouldn't. Those don't meet that requirement, but they're just little treats that we put in, um, our handy little jar over here. And he just gets them when he goes potty or whatever it may be. Um, so he's not getting a ton of them and they're small. It's, that was a huge explanation for nothing, but, um, I've got some strawberry ice cream, which has chocolate ice cream all over the top of it, which has me a little concerned, but it doesn't look, well, I guess it is leaking on the top a little bit there. Um, but we have some chocolate ice cream as well. Uh, sorry about this week. Uh, and some orange cream ice so cream. I apologize, the lighting is probably not great and it's gonna be all shadowy and I can't really make it better, the lights over there, but I don't have anywhere to put my phone up over there. Um, but I just wanted to set it down so I could kind of start getting some of this stuff uh, like opened up so I can put it away. Um, but just wanted to thank you guys for watching today's grocery haul. I know I said I wanted to make it short and sweet if I could. Um, hopefully this won't drag it out too long. Um, but just for anyone who's still here, I appreciate anybody that has been watching. Um, especially if you're coming back and watching these videos that, to be quite honest, over the last month or two have been 
very sporadic. Um, I just, I, I have a lot going on all the time, which I know everyone does and people make time for what's important to them. I'm a full believer in that. Um, unfortunately for me, this is fun. It's like a little hobby. It's just a silly little project. Like I just do it because I think it's fun and I love watching this kind of stuff. Um, so I thought it would kind of, you know, be fun to do it myself as well. But I have a full-time job. I have horses to take care of, a dog to take care of, um, a husband with a full-time job who also works some side work as well. Um, I own a small business. Are you okay? Are you begging? Um, I just, there's a lot. Like there's a lot in my everyday life and this is for fun. So as much as I want to make it a big priority and put an importance on getting my videos up every week, it's just not always realistic and I have to be okay with the fact that I can't always get everything done or do everything that I want to do. Sometimes I just can can only do the things that I have to do. Um, and put the fun kind of projects and hobbies aside. Um, if you know me in my personal life, you know this is absolutely true because I don't ride my horse near as much as I'd like to. I don't show as much as I'd like to. I don't, there's a lot of things I'd like to do um, that are for fun or hobbies that I can't always do. And that's part of being an adult and I make it work. So, um, I'm going to keep just doing my best to make this work also do it whenever I can. Um, I'm going to miss some weeks. Sometimes I'm going to have things come up. Um, I'm going to have people at my house doing things or have to pick up groceries like at a random time or on a random day or something where I just don't have the time to video. So I hope you'll stick around. I hope that you enjoy the videos I do put up and I definitely will continue to try to get more up. Um, I just want to keep it realistic and, and be open and honest with anybody that is, you know, spending their time watching these. So I appreciate anyone who is, um, if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, I would really appreciate it. If you subscribed, then you'll know <laughs> when my videos come up because I'd love to have the schedule of Oh, I go to the grocery store every Tuesday, so a video will be up every Tuesday or Wednesday. Um, but I don't always go on Tuesday or Wednesday. Some days I can't make that happen and I don't go till later in the week or I know we have a busy week coming up, so I suffer and go on a Sunday when the grocery store is packed, um, which I try not to do, but it happens. So um, yeah, if you're subscribed and following along then uh you'll know when I skip a week or post on a random day um and hopefully you'll still watch it and enjoy being here with me anyway so thank you guys so much I love you all and I hope you have a great day